this all right this is taurus rising tarot make sure you guys like share and subscribe if you want a more personal you can reach me at patreon.com forward slash taurus rising tarot all right tauruses uh y'all got me pulling out the duke of all trade you know what i mean there's a bunch of people in your damn energy i want to know who Ooh, first first and i see is the hangman i see a cancer I see a leo First and foremost, if your ass is 18, you need to get your ass out of here, okay? There will also be an extended to this, okay? Cool. All right, let's get started. All right, first and foremost, Tauruses, the energy that I have from y'all is... Ooh, energy. Energy, 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 energy. Okay, so you don't like their energy. Okay, so they coming in with this this strong ass energy. Okay, so somebody is wrong with admitting their energy. Okay, so we're going off of your north node now. Okay, so check your north node sign. It's going to make a lot more sense. All right, uh, the moon is in Pisces, so you don't really feel any type of way. Okay, the only thing you know is somebody don't need to come around with that badass energy. That's what you do know. All right. I don't see that you're kind of in your head. You're just being very, what is it called? Uh, is it simplexity? All right. Either we moving forward or we're not. Okay. But we do need to strengthen something because the shit in the past has been toxic. All right. I'm not going to continue this relationship or I'm not going to continue the situation for as long as, um, you don't want to fix something or we could fix it together. All right. So this person is taller than you. Okay. I'm getting a big ass height variation here. Okay. Um, somebody could also be with child. I feel like you're seeing the foot, okay, in your stomach or on your stomach here. Somebody has a fascination for birds. You could be buying a bird, okay? There's something missing here, all right? There's somebody missing here out of this situation and equation, all right? So, because I'm getting, you know, a, okay, so I'm not going to say third party yet, so give me a second. Something's very toxic, though. I feel like you feel this energy, or you know this energy is here okay so you've asked this leo like yo what the fuck is to you like can you tell the truth about this situation and scenario please all right i feel like it is something that you want somebody that you want to talk to i feel like they're telling you to be patient don't be patient do not be patient the reason i'm saying it is because imagine you being patient and waiting for the situation and scenario yeah and then they do something else I feel like somebody from your past is coming back, though. Why this person is telling you to be patient, I feel like somebody from your past is coming back because I've seen the tower in reverse. Could be dating a Capricorn, but I'm really just getting toxicity here. Yeah. I feel like, yeah, I got the tower in reverse again. All right. And I got the Empress. Okay, so that's you. All right. And I got the Hierophant. Wow, that's you again. So somebody wants to come back. I'm seeing the judgment in reverse and I'm seeing the moon. Okay, so the moon is in Pisces. So you could be dating a Pisces. I feel like this person is definitely deep in thought. They're definitely deep in their head, okay? I feel like this person thought something was a good ass idea and I feel like they're quickly realizing that this shit was not a good idea at all. Like, it was a bad idea. Bad idea. But I feel like because they fucked up, I feel like now they know that they have to be patient. I feel like now they know they have to wait for you because when you were uh, waiting for them, they fucked up. All right, let's get into the reading. You know, Taurus is our role now for their facial expressions. Like, a Taurus will literally have their whole nose flared out and they lip up looking at you with one fucking eye closed. And they look like they about to pass the fuck out. But it's clearly, <laughs> if somebody were to run up and do some type of commentation, they would be like, the Taurus is basically telling you that you get on their fucking nerves and to get the fuck out of their face. <laughs> That's just what I'm hearing. Somebody's like, I feel like somebody's like translating like how you feel. So this could be a friend. So you could be telling, you could tell your friend like, oh, tell them I'm in the shower or tell them I'm doing this or tell them I'm doing that. And I feel like somebody literally is going in. Like somebody's telling somebody, yo, somebody, something, somebody, something that you didn't even probably say shit. That is hilarious. All right. So I got the 10 of swords. All right. So I feel like you feel some type of way. You still a little confused in regards to a situation and scenario, but I feel like, you know, something is best. Okay. I feel like you know you need to do this in order to get the results that you want. This is why you're being patient, okay? So I feel like the, another reason for patience is because you know that 
you're not at your best anyway and it's certain things that you still would like to do so this could be on the financial um front but i also feel like this is different pentacles that you're trying to reach in different um avenues that you're trying to reach in your life different barriers that you're trying to reach in your life i feel like you're halfway there so i feel like you know this is another reason that you have to put this two of cups or this situation on um the back burner all right i feel like somebody also is trying to grow their money just a little bit more enough for them to pay for whatever this is you could be dating a virgo i feel like somebody doesn't want to sign they're like i don't know i don't i don't want to sign i'm not really sure yet okay i feel like you're asking this person to sign it's crazy because i haven't seen any swords yet besides the two of swords but i'm getting aquarius energy here yeah look okay something is blank you like wait what the fuck like I, I, it's something missing here all right so let me see i agree like i agree something is missing so i feel like that's what you kind of like focused on now you're really focusing on what this is that's missing yeah because i feel like no the illusions no longer matter are you not worried about that all right now you're trying to figure out where are we going with this all right so now you're asking the hard questions and i feel like for as long as somebody can't answer those questions you're not trying to move forward yeah i'm getting aries leo sage Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, all right? Yeah, I feel like something is blank. And I feel like this is the only reason that you haven't gotten over this or this is the only thing that has you stuck right now is because you can't figure out what this is. If you could figure out what that was, I feel like you would have been done with the situation and scenario. It wouldn't even bother you anymore. You wouldn't even be concerned with it. I feel like it's just it's just a matter of like I'm so confused like I'm just so confused like I I don't understand why like and I don't understand the need I don't understand the purpose I'm not understanding the point of this shit okay so you could be saying that to somebody yeah I got the high priestess okay so you could be saying this to a Pisces the moon is in Pisces okay all right I got the five of cups here so I feel like something was unnecessary as shit like it was unnecessary for them to either say something do something but it's still a blank canvas. I feel like you don't even know what the fuck to do with this shit right now. I feel like you don't know what to do, but I feel like you are making peace or you're accepting peace in this scenario. yeah i got the six of cups yeah okay so i feel like you're trying to figure out how you ended up in this situation okay so this is the missing link all right so the missing link is how the hell like did this happen whatever this is for you to feel this way when you've been so giving or so caring how could somebody betray this all right i feel like you really don't want the relationship back i feel like you just want your energy back you want your power back i feel like you're a tad bit confused, all right? Now, some will say, because the energy I'm getting is that they don't care about a relationship, right? They don't want a relationship anyway. And I don't think that you necessarily do. I just feel like you don't want this to happen again, whatever this is. Yeah. Because you don't want this to affect you moving forward when it comes to getting into another relationship. I feel like you just want to release the toxicity from this person. Could be dealing with a Capricorn. You want to release the toxicity from this person. But I feel like it's still something missing. It's not that hard to be a leader. I also feel like it's better for you to not be on social media. So I feel like you're getting off of social media. And I feel like the more you do that, the happier you are. Oh, wow. I got the four of wands. So this says energy, will, desire, and change. So like I said before, I feel like something is just confusing here. All right. So let me see. Because I feel like it's some bullshit. I'm just going to be honest. I'll also go over this in the extended yeah okay so somebody knows what you want you could also be saying like okay the beginning started out so perfect or this could be right now because i'm seeing marriage 
I'm seeing energy, will, desire, change. So I definitely know somebody's in your energy. I definitely know that you want something. I definitely know that you desire something. And I definitely know that somebody either wants to change to be what you want enough for you to marry them and make you happy. But I feel like you're confused about the situation and scenario basically because of how they were moving. But I feel like it could be done. Wow. Man, I got the nine of pentacles. So this could be somebody coming back around to make amends. Because I feel like this person, yeah, definitely. So somebody's definitely coming around to make amends. All right. This person is not the same person as you've seen from them in the past. All right. I feel like now they want to, to, to um, help you or to offer you or to be there for you. Okay. I feel like you're going to see more synchronicity. So this could be a Gemini or a Taurus Virgo Capricorn, Aries Leo Sedge. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I'm getting Pisces too. Yeah, I feel like somebody's trying to call a truce. All right, because I feel like you walked away, and I feel like now they don't want any drama. They want to call the. They want to call a truce here. Because I feel like your your relationship was one that was that people like to see. I feel like people um. If you publicly announce this relationship, I feel like people want to see this work. And I feel like you want this to work, or you will. I'm seeing the Knight of Swords and the Chariot. So you could be dealing with a cancer, but I feel like something needs to move forward. Yeah. I feel like you're going from storm to sun. So I see something that could something that could work out. Wow, I just said sun, didn't I? So I feel like this is a rebuilding process. Yeah, somebody wants to build something from the ground up again. Somebody wants to talk to you. Somebody wants to make things stable. Could be a cap, but I, I just feel like somebody wants to offer your, your love, um, their love to you. I feel like it's still a tad bit immature. I feel like they still have a little bit more seasoning to go. But for the most part, I do feel like they have been planning this for a really long time. And I feel like they have said on plenty of occasions, if they had the opportunity to get back with you, what they would do. And I feel like now they're living up to that. This could be a Leo. All right. But I feel like with this moon, it's all about the energy. Okay. It's all about the energy. So I feel like now it's up to you to figure out what energy you want or what angle you want to come from. If this is something you want to do, it is a bit confusing, but I feel like it's going to work out. If your person goes to you and you haven't talked to them since I don't know when, it's telling you to do um, uh, manifestations. Okay. So manifest on November the 30th. I feel like there's a Leo watching you or a, a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio watching you. If you are, if this is not your story, I feel like somebody's watching you or somebody's going to reach out. Uh, additionally, I guess somebody else should not watch somebody else's story. Okay. They know that that's you or you know that that's somebody because you don't talk to whoever that person is. It's a fake account watching your story. So we'll talk about this more in the extended. I'll actually use a different deck here to go over that. All right. I'll see y'all there. Thanks.